Yard move is a special status that became a part of the hours of service rules when ELD was coming out. It allows you to move the truck in private parking areas, but count it as on-duty time rather than as driving time. It allows you to move around private areas, but not spend your driving time, you know, your 11-hour clock doing it. Instead, it only counts against your 14-hour clock. Instances where you could use it for a prolonged activity include while doing a drop and hook at a ship or receiver, looking for your container at a rail ramp, or moving trailers like a spotter at the JAS yard. Being that we do intermodal, the best place to use it is the railroad ramp. That's where you're going to spend the most time moving the truck, but not essentially driving because you're in a private area looking for your container or in dealing with the ramp mechanics, getting a container flipped, but you could use it at an intermodal yard or port facility, a motor carrier's place of business, a shipper's privately owned parking lot. What would not qualify for a yard move? Well, public roads, you can never use yard move while on a public road. Another would be public rest areas. This would include gas stations that are open to the public. So while you could use yard move at the Alsip Truck Center, because that's a private facility, you couldn't do it at a Shell gas station or a rest stop for trucks. If you leave yourself in yard move and drive on public roads, you should contact a member of the safety team immediately. The quicker they can notate your log with the correct information, the better. Mistakes happen. If you let us know right away, we can help you fix the problem. It's not by any way a guarantee that you won't get a violation for a false log, but notating it in a timely manner can prevent the violation. No one is perfect, so if you alert safety to it, notating the log will be the only thing that happens. If you don't alert them, you likely will be getting a remedial class on log books and losing a potential day of work. When you don't alert the safety team, your actions look willful and deceptive, even if that isn't your intent. So please, always alert the safety team if you do leave yourself on yard move accidentally.